ஹாய் டியர்ஸ் குட் மார்னிங் எவ்ரிபடி இந்த லாஸ்ட் கிளாஸ் வி ஸ்டடிட் அபவுட் ஆஸ்ட்ராய்ட்ஸ் டுடே வி ஸ்டார்ட் வித் டெஃப் பிளானட் ஃபார் அ செலஸ்டில் பாடி டு பி கன்சிடர்ட் ஆஸ் அ பிளானட் இட் ஷுட் ஹாவ் ஸ்பியரிக்கல் ஷேப் ஷுட் ரிவால்வ் அரவுண்ட் தி சன் ஷுட் ஹாவ் இட்ஸ் ஆன் obstacle free orbit the celestial bodies which do not follow these conditions set by the international astronomical union or iau or iau are called deaf planets are called deaf planet okay pluto was considered as a planet till very recently the international astronomical union withdrew its status and declared pluto as a dwarf planet in august 2006 such a decision was due to the fact that pluto crosses the orbit of neptune yes a celestial body considered as a planet it have its own obstacle free orbit okay now what is a comet the comets are guest in the solar system comets comets are guest in the solar system rarely visitors they rarely visitors to the solar system they are lumps of cosmic dust and snow particles how their tail is formed their tail is formed as they approach the sun and it glows in the sunlight though they revolve around the sun they come close to the sun very rarely the length and brightness of the comets tail increase as it approach the sun the comet ison ison the comet ison which arrived by the end of 2030 okay what is meteoroids how many you notice light beams flashing in the sky during clear nights this disappear suddenly this disappear in no time before one can show it to another person such rock farm, fragments of various size which enter into the earth's atmosphere are called meteoroids they burn due to the friction with air on entering into the atmosphere they burn due to the friction with air on entering into the atmosphere this is the flash that we see in the sky the unburned remains of the meteors falling on the earth are called meteoroids okay you have learned that solar system include sun planets their satellites asteroids comets and the dwarf planets once again i repeat solar system includes sun the planets their satellites asteroids comets dwarf planet meteoroids etc meteoroids etc the earth is the only planet where life is found to exist vast expanse of surface water reserve exists only only on the earth when viewed from space the earth's color appears to be pale blue when viewed from the space the earth's color appears to be pale blue this is due to the fact that two third of the earth's surface is covered with water 
to third of the earth's surface is covered with water okay today i conclude my class dears <coughs> i send some questions the answers of that question to me thank you